Welcome to Talking Trash. You remember when we last talked, we talked about recycling and different things that we could recycle? Well, let's talk about some interesting facts about recycling. I always want to know, if I recycle, how does that help us? How does that help the environment? So I have some facts that I'd like to share with you today. So if you want to jot down facts, get a pen and a pen, pen and a piece of paper out. So in general, the average American will throw away 600 times their weight, their own weight. I think that's just interesting. They'll throw that in the garbage over a lifetime. 90,000 pounds or 47 and a half ton in a lifetime. I suppose that depends on how much you weigh, but, but that's the average American. I just thought that was really interesting. Um, Energy Star equipment, so if you buy uh, an appliance or, or a fluorescent, compact fluorescent bulb, things like that, those, uh, those, that equipment uses 65% less electricity than a regular incandescent bulb or the older type appliances that are not Energy Star. So when you're looking for appliances, definitely look for Energy Star appliances or, or utensils that you can buy, it's definitely worth it. And it also saves in the pocketbook. It's, it really is helpful. Anybody have any ideas when the first recycling program started? 1890s, in the 1890s. That's a long time ago, so we've been recycling a long time. In Becker County, we've been recycling since about 1980. So we've been recycling a long time too. Guess how many, how much of our landfill space is in packaging? Have you been shopping lately? Have you looked at packaging? One third of our landfill space is in packaging. To me, that's just interesting. So when you're shopping, kind of check out and see how much you really don't need to buy. Can you buy something in bulk? Can you buy something with a little less packaging? It'll save you in the long run. It'll save on your garbage bill. It'll really make a difference. So how about energy usage? In 2000. Eight, Americans and Energy Star saved enough energy to power 10 million homes. That's amazing. 10 million homes, and this is nationally. What percentage of a building is inefficient in energy usage? 30%. Isn't that amazing that a building is energy efficient by about 30% if you have done no upgrades for your building. So if you redo your bulbs, or you do, redo windows, anything like that, 30%. So when everybody's concentrating on increasing their energy efficiency, concentrating on keeping the heat in your building, keeping the lighting bright and using less energy, that's the, a great thing to do. And to me, just those little things make such a difference. It's amazing. How about water facts? I thought this was interesting. Water facts. Between 1950 and 2000, the U.S. population nearly doubled. However, however, in that same period, the demand for water more than tripled. I think that's interesting. They say by the, by the year 2013, 36 states will anticipate water shortages. So we don't think about that so much in Minnesota. We think more of clean. But I, to me, that's interesting. And we'll share some more facts in the next show. Thanks.